this. And the first thing you hear is the word this. Hi, welcome back. We, uh... Yeah. So we did... We, we futzed around for a couple hours. Uh, there's a hole. There's a hole we must go to. You know what? Our horse should not even be this close to hole. Discovery. <coughs> go there. In the dark? Go in the dark. Whoa! <laughs> Hey, what's the big idea? You can't just walk up behind someone who's standing at the edge of chasm again. My colleague he works with me on the Zonai survey team is down there. What happened if I slipped and fell on it? Fell on him, huh? Huh? To start my again. Deep in my investigation work at the moment. I see. So just yeah. Go in there. Go in the hole. Jesus fucking Christ. Honk. Ah, I see. He took a balloon. That does make a lot more sense. How far did Robbie go? Are you Link? Pleasure to meet you. I am Ponic from the Zonai survey team. Robbie told me to guide you to him once you arrived. But he rushed along with such haste that I didn't bring enough bright bloom seeds, and now I've run out. So I lost sight of him. Oh. In the dark? Thought he was taking a short walk over to that glowing area over there. And he just kept going. Lucas <laughs> raised my fish because he just dives everywhere. And going. And last I saw him, he was heading way out, out there off to the west. This seems like a bad idea to be here. Do you have any bright bloom seeds with you? I do. Ah. Oh, that's great news. Light from the surface doesn't reach down here, as you might have noticed. You're risking your life to wander here without a light source, you know. You can easily get bright bloom seeds from caves, and they light up. They light up if struck, so they're pretty easy to use too. We use seeds all the time on the Zonai survey team. The simplest way is to throw them out with your hand. Ah. Those of us skilled with the bow will attach them to arrows and fire them off into the distance down here. I have done that. If you're gonna explore the depths, take plenty of these seeds with you. Alright, here we go. <gasps> Underground bug. Underground bug. Underground bug. Under Deep Firefly, a multi wing insect that lives in the depths that creates a luminescent elements that can be cooked into an elixir, which will add a faint glow to anyone who consumes it. I don't need no bright bloom seeds. I got that motherfucking glow. Alright, so... Let's see the range on one of these bad boys. Not bad. So do light roots. Central area. What if I touch it with my hand? Come here. Oh, would you look at that? Incredibly huge light source. Go figure. With plants. Neat. Ah! Oh, where's it go? And a waypoint. Underground map updated? Yeah. Yeah. The light would dispel the darkness and brighten the surrounding area. You'll probably want to do more of these. Look at me. Oh, there's bad goop here. Don't go in there.
Hey, you! It's really dark down here. Not one, not one bit of light gets here from the surface. Even my goggles, I can hardly see. I really should have brought some bright bloom seeds with me. <laughs> but I'm a moron. As one of the few sources of light, the glowing root growing down from above has piqued my curiosity. I'm not sure what it is, but it looks harmless enough. This place is roughly under the shrine of the surface. Hmm. Anyway, I'm off to the glowing root. I see shining west of here. So you better hurry up and get moving. I guess I should. Where's West? <laughs> There's West. <laughs> you saw one down there? Don't make me climb in the goop. I don't got the phase on suit yet. Don't do this to me. No, he had other landmarks. I got it. Yeah, there's fire. I also forgot which way west was, anyways. That was east. By the way, don't touch the goop. <laughs> the dynamic soundtrack uh, goes real fucking evil when you get near it. Which is awesome. Shoving several bugs in my pockets. Muddle bud. A wildflower from power with a powerful odor that can disorient and confuse, making it difficult to tell friend from foe. Yo, we got confusion flowers in this? Hey you, still alive? Looks like this place is swimming in gloom. Get too close to that stuff and you're asking for trouble. If a guy didn't have any bright blooms, it'd be curtains. And again, it's my first time down here, and I haven't kicked the bucket, so I'm sure you'll be fine. I just spotted something of interest in my goggles. It's shaped like a figure jo Joshua wants us to find. I'll be continuing to head west towards one of those glowing roots I see ahead. See you soon. Thanks. You have a lot of faith in whoever's reading this. <laughs> I'm waiting for someone special. It's the girl reading this. Bomb plant. Nice. Oh, that's a rock. The darkness was a. Uh, oh my goodness. Ah. The light has confused. What was that noise? Didn't mean to do that. Count that back. Thank you. Ow. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. This is all bad. <laughs> this is all bad. <laughs> I see. Perhaps I will just keep to the darkness for a little bit. If it's all the same to them. <laughs> I do count those round-eared freaks as a different fantasy race. Puffshroom. Mushroom that spreads a cloud of fine spores when the stimulus is applied. The bitter powder makes them inedible. But it makes... Some shit happen, so hey, you know. Cramming bugs in my pockets. Nothing but bugs in my pockets. Oh. Oh. Yeah. 
the dangers of having light sources is that sometimes people see you and sometimes you can see them and nobody wants that Some bad dudes down here. Some absolutely wicked hombres. Oh my god! <laughs> the wicked hombres! You saw me? What the fuck? God, you guys are full of rocks. Never mind, I have to kill all of you. And a rock hammer. Aracuda. This eyeball is constantly trying to focus on targets. Cook it with a critter to make an elixir or attach it to an arrow to grant home and go. I love that. Just putting fucking eyeballs on arrows makes them home. It's so funny. No! You can't make me! Oh, I... Get fucked. Stupid. Yeah, I should probably be using it. Because, yeah, being able to... No, not that one. That one. Give me that. Yo, Robbie! Check this shit out! Watch an old man? Light spelled the symbol of the darkness. Check that shit out. Anyways. Yo, Robbie! Oh, yeah, look at that. That was kind of some weird cows. Hey, man. What? Look how bright that thing got. Light down in the dark is downright refreshing. Mm -hmm. In fact, it's so luminous, it's almost like, like we're on the surface. Standing near makes me feel so much better. How strange. Hey, it's you. You're finally here. I need to show you what I found. The statue. It's dang tall and two legs. One arm reached high. Looks an awful like that figure just showed us on the piece of slate, don't you think? Alright, get that camera of yours ready. It's time to put it to work. That's right. Forgot you hadn't used the camera when we last spoke. Very curious indeed, given it's one of the pure pet's basic features. Give me your phone. Well, there's the problem. Camera's locked, and so's your Hyrule Compendium. Hang on. I remember correctly, you press this while you pull this and then you tap that, and then. Oh, cool, it's on the quick select menu. That's it. That's good. Capture images using the Puro Pad. You can then save them to the album. 
Yay! I can take pictures of so many horses. Boom! Now you should be able to fuse both the camera, use, use even, both the camera and your Hyrule Compendium. So, go capture a picture of that statue. This is a good chance to verify that it's working properly, too. Test it out. Experience is the best teacher, after all. Once you capture the image, come back here. I want to see how it looks. Okay, that is, that's the button to use. <laughs> Get your bow out of the frame. <laughs> Research. Ew, how'd that go? Can't retrieve that statue with a the camera, then hurry up and show me. I'd like to see how it looks. You were close. So, did you get a good picture? Oh, probably not. <laughs> Stupendous. Looks like he really captured it well. I'm sure Joshua will be satisfied with this. Lighting up that immense root. Getting us a picture of that statue. Just start helping us research with sand here, but soon we're going to have even more to investigate. Well then, it's time I head back to the surface. See so you look at landing. Don't make Joseph wait too long for that picture. I know you've got a third world to explore and all that, but you know. Yeah, bear in mind. Yeah, but what if I mapped a little bit more? Would you be mad? Get Yeah, the whole damage from the gloom thing seems to be a real bummer. <laughs> well, okay. The reason you could not see them is because they were blocked by... Your view was blocked by a tree. Don't look at me. Time to test the theory. Nick a yam shrine. Me at the thanks. <laughs> Light root, yeah. 
<laughs> Me at Thanksgiving dinner. Yay! Okay. That is what I thought might happen by these. But does it only happen upon retrieval, or does it happen if you just kind of enter their, their serene grace? I would like to think if you just come in. Is a pin here? Well, there's a pin there. I said, oh, cool, it's, it actually is signifying that it's not on this level, but you are under it. Well, I do remember there being a shrine or something around here. Anyways, hey, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. The, the dark world is really cool and all. Anyways, I'm gonna do something else. <laughs> do I want to do in this in this great wide world? There's so much to do, so much to see. I suppose Kakarika Village is, is calling to us a little bit. Dark World is really cool. Like, I... It's so scary, though. Like, I, I am fully, like, intimidated. So... Ugh, I feel awful. Stop hanging by the goop. Hey, Traveler, I'd stay, <laughs> I'd stay away from that stuff if you care about your health. What's calling it gloom? If you get any on it, you'll start losing your strength like it's sapping your life away. I trust some gloom will poke around in the depths and that'll look at me. Worst of it will recover on its own little by little, so long as you're on the surface. Well, that's good. It is! They made it really properly scary and dangerous, actually. While you're in the depths, you won't recover at all. I thought I was going to die down there. Okay, so, so, uh, so Robbie was fully insinuating that being by the bright plumes is like being on the surface and will recover your gloom. Got it. I'm completely relying on Devol, so I really want to recover by noon. Motherfucker spotted. Come here, website. Kids are calling it gloom. You get it on your skin and it eats away at you and you start to stay out of the light. Oh, I thought these were collectible. Well, I guess... Oh, hold on. Pearl wanted to talk... Or, sorry. What's her face? What's her nuts? <laughs> Josha wanted some reports. She wants to see my cool selfie. And then we got a tower, and then we got a shrine. We got so much to do. What? It's just a cart. Pass it. I love the planes. Scorpus. Can't believe they put Scorpion in this game. Success! Hey, you! Should have shown the picture you took of the statue. The figure matches up pretty well, and it looks darn cool, too. <laughs> I hate how this worked. This is it! This does match what's in the fragment. Yeah. Thank you, swordsman. Just like on the slate, I figured this would be this must be showing people of some sort, whoever they were. Sorry. Showing people of some sort, whoever they were. Which confirms my theory that people lived in the depths. I'm sure we'll be find more traces of them if we keep searching. This is a big, big disco big discovery. Three. Three bigs. Now, what's next? The possibilities. There's so much more to research. Oh, before I focus on that, something I want to give you is thanks for helping with this stage of my investigation. Our earliest, our earlier surveys of the depths found all this. What do you think it's for? 
Oh man, I'm gonna make so much rock. Hmm. Feels as if these contain some kind of strange power. Like maybe it's energy or something. Anyway, they might help you in your search for Princess Zelda. So hopefully you find them useful. Whoa. That fragment will help to see the depths in a new, new way. Now we're closer to understanding one of its mysteries. I'm going to sift through everything that our servers have brought back from down here. Maybe there are even more fragments that I can piece together. Goggles. Swordsman. <laughs> Thank you, sir. <laughs> Your Pokemon journey starts today. <laughs> Thank you so much for going to investigate the depths for me. You must get to the lab. Alright. Yeah, unleash me. Impa and the geoglyphs. Alright. They are over there, which is not where I'm heading. But, it could be. I do just kind of want to get this tower. That's the problem. It's open world game. I see tower and I'm like, that thing's begging to be climbed. Okay, old man, you've been distra- You've been- I've been- I keep noticing you. Hold on. What's up? What's up, Les Lester? I think you caused quite a stir since you're a rival here. <laughs> People do fuss, don't they? This is your first visit. Talk to that soldier in the center of our little fort. Oh, were you hoping to register a horse? Still getting things together on that front, so I'm afraid you'll have to hold on to hold your horses for a little while longer. <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> I used to work at Rado Stable in Ebra. I had a good job taking care of horses. But the cold there kept getting colder and business got slower in time. We had to close. Last I heard, the place had been bought out by the Lucky Clover Gazette. Ah. Just when I was feeling adrift, Pura reached out to me about managing the horses here at Lookout Landing. Before I knew it, here I was. You sure bundle up if you're going to Hebra. Cold over there is intense. Eat some chilies. Why is it floating? <laughs> Chili peppers. Ah, uh, the gentle calm of just riding your horse. Damn, it's raining a lot these days. What the hell? Bulnasaur. You know what? We'll head to the shrine first. That's more or less on the way. Or at least parallel. This is the only exception of when I kill foxes is if I run them over with my horse. It's usually on accident. That time was maybe a little less accidental. <laughs> Meets meat. Come on, website. What the hell are these boys doing over here? My Boko Reaper. If only I had some way of immediately getting that one back. <laughs> ah, more troublemakers. You know what? Oh my god. <laughs> this thing is so powerful. Man. This might be too good for them. Get my hoe here. Where 
Where'd all your horns go? Horse noise. Yeah, yeah, I know, you're pathfinding. Pathfinding. <laughs> Nothing weird about this place, right? Don't look like it. Alright, you guys aren't weird, are you? Breath of the Wild, I was uh, proud to say that I looked up only one shrine and it was very, very deep into the game. And I otherwise retained a complete blindness to the entirety of its content, of the game's contents, and just naturally filled out my map, did all the fun things. So far, only Pura is has been spoiled for me, I realize. And, and, like, maybe some generic contraptions that people have made before. But, like, I have otherwise been... I'm, I'm fresh as a daisy. And this is incredibly ideal. Skateboard. Hey, what? I'll stop you for a second. No, 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 no. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, dragon wheels. You stop. Yep. Martha. <laughs> yeah, it's fresh as a daisy. Now that you have witnessed Dragon Wheel. You too may experience the joys. You know, maybe level out a bit. No, <laughs> no, Are you kidding me? Uh, why would you do this to me, game? Ha ha ha, I love running into traffic. Give me the server real quick. Ha 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 ha. I love running into traffic. It's a little misaligned. Well, no, not really, I guess. Modern problems need modern solutions. Like, propping your car. Vroom!
Don't be a narc. <laughs> that only that only required one turn. You son of a bitch. You son of a bitch. <laughs> John Nintendo, you son of a bitch. You brilliant, brilliant asshole. Well, no, 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 no. <laughs> that's one way to fail. <sighs> okay, oh, this is a platform. This is a platform. Okay. What a fun game. Can't wait to get to the real weird shit. That one, like, <laughs> one where I had to sort of press the wheel and wedge it was a little annoying, but hey. Yeah. Now when do I get axles? You start giving me access to axles, <laughs> then I'm a. Uh, then I'm set to just make a car. Or is it? Or, I don't know. Am I thinking of the wrong thing? What the thing that? I guess it's it's the device that makes you turn an axle, right? Is that still just another axle? Can I cross axles? If I say axle enough, will it lose its meaning? There's just a thing over here. I'd like to add, to name that the blue zone. <gasps> no! Oh, my friend and I got separated. Build me into a car. Friend is sending up a smoke signal. I can't wait to catch up. I'm so tired, though. I can't move. <laughs> this horse don't want none of that. Understandable. Oh, I, I won't do. 
<laughs> gotta, gotta just uh, shimmy and shake it. All right, buddy, are you ready for the ride of your life? You're a little off balance, I'll admit. Yeah, that's better. We're on a slope now, so it's probably fine if I just aim you like. Like so? <laughs> Racy there. Oh no! Race you there. <laughs> Buddy, I think the solution. I'm trying to race you there, dude. I have to reach my friend Blaze. Will you stop fucking around? It'll be fine. <laughs> it really does immediately roll him over, doesn't it? All right, all right, all right. Hold on. I'm mastering the hunt. <laughs> All your fruits are Whoa. <laughs> Hey, this is fucked up. Hey, this is... And so, man proved his dominion over Earth. You had a lizard in here? Yeah, sure. Boy, I wish I had just easy bombs. We, we, we don't. <laughs> Wizard of Oz quote in which Dorothy says, Mmm, yumby apple. I'm going to eat it. Okay, buddy, I'll hit you there. We just need to make some slight adjustments. <laughs> T 
<laughs> Please don't roll down the hill. Surely this will give you a little bit more stability. Than just your body. Alright. I'll even join you. Watch out, Fox! Watch out, Fox! Yeah. See, this works a lot better. Your bulbous bag was... was kind of the main problem. You good? <laughs> the new dropping rocks on Koroks is dropping Koroks onto their face. Horse? Are you too far away? Is that a new shrine? Did I just roll up on a shrine? I suppose it's not unheard of. Oh, he did hear me. Website! Let's go! Oh, there's the tower too. Well, I mean, if there's a shrine right there. Then, yeah. Well, you can't just get that. I'm sure I'll learn how to use those inside. Get out of this rain. I fixed a device. Some kind of uh, strange rod to attach, to affix. Oh! God, get started. Fuck it. Start a fucking counter of how many times I do that. Huh? Break the targets! Give me that. Oh. We are making the pinned ball. No. Get on the other device. Oh. I see. Whoa, okay. It's, can you... I... God damn it, dude! Let me cook! Oh, 
Okay, it's only from these. This does not have the necessary devices to spin. I see. Baseball. Da -da -da -da. Mm. <laughs> Baseball. Extreme thirst. Move. Can you get? There we go. <laughs> He's out of there, but do you want bonus? Front hand, back hand. All right, back. <laughs> may require me to die I should just I got I want to solve the baseball puzzle I want to solve the puzzle of baseball <laughs> game mover yeah that's me <sighs> well now I gotta hit that target again this treasure is probably not even going to be worth it. Game mover. <laughs> I need to just use the stairs or jump. <laughs> For fuck's sake. <laughs> Damn it. Thank you. 
Hey, man, I wanted that distinctly at an angle, but sure. Oh, okay. Don't fall in the fucking pit. Okay. So the trajectory we want is... Somewhat similar. But we also need that thing out of the way. If only a little. What if we just what if we just have this one straight straight pinball flipper? No, 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 no. Son of a bitch. <laughs> I know what I want out of this. Yeah, sure. <laughs> no, never mind. Fucking, I don't know, dude. There. That's probably as clear a runway as we'll get for that. <laughs> I don't know. Well, now you really fucked it. Now you just missed. Okay, 
missed again. Well, shit. <laughs> missed again. Perfect baseball. Hmm. Quite the conundrum. Maybe backhanding, isn't it? I don't know. Saying my perfect backhanding strategy is not perfect. Did I lose one of my sticks? <laughs> I lost one of my sticks. <laughs> In the war. Okay. Yeah, maybe backhanding ain't it. Not at that angle anyways. <laughs> you son of a bitch. <laughs> Wait! Oh, there's the other one. Didn't mean to attach it. Uh. <laughs> I don't think this is gonna work. <laughs> that was a backhand. My bad. Hello? Get out of here! Goodbye. <laughs> it's going right for it! 
How much will I fuck up if I move all this? <laughs> we can fix this. This is salvageable. It just needs to be anchored somewhere else. I'm realizing something about this whole arrangement. I don't need all this shit. <laughs> I just needed a simple, elegant spike. Maybe two. There. <sighs> Solving problems with shakes. Overthink step one, overthink everything. Wow, you uh really uh took your time on that one, huh? Uh well, here's your orb of light. Thanks, mom and dad of everybody. I guess. Rauru. Two to go. Thank you. I got very hurt doing that one of all of them. Of all the ones to get severely hurt by, <laughs> Pinball was not the one I expected. No, no, no. Not Pinball. Is that your... I suppose you're right. much.
to learn. Wow, big battery! It's only charged with a massive energy stored within. Put in a Zona device dispenser or use it to temporarily prevent a Zona energy cell from using power. Losing power. I love Zonai bits! Alright, here we go. Well, this appears to be some kind of fortress. Nothing comes easy. Oh, we gotta we gotta storm them if we want to use this tower. And they're blue here. Yeah, you want some? You know what? You make a great point. <laughs> da -da -da -da. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there goes my just the arm, huh? Okay. Understandable. That's a sturdy wooden stick. Say. Oh, that did not add the the length I was expecting, but you know what? That's fine. Flame emitter club does emit flame at least. Let's go light some people on fire. Yo, moblin. Yeah, pick one of those up. Well, one of us got out of that. And it was me. The one with the shield. Well, that's one less. What the fuck? Did you guys roll down a bunch of explosives? What is that? You rolled down a giant iron ball. I see. This is a sturdy wooden stick. That's what that is. Use it to make all sorts of fun objects. I'm gonna put a carrot on it. Just kidding. I'm gonna put one of those. I'm gonna make a wicked sword. Who throws a giant? <laughs> what are you people? <laughs> oh, you motherfuckers aren't ready for this. <laughs> That's not the right button. <laughs> it turned out I wasn't ready for this. Oh yeah, great fairies. Man. Well, at least that chest is done. It doesn't exist anymore.
I'm gonna conquer these motherfuckers. This thing's really cumbersome, actually. Get out of here. I liked my old plan of lighting you on fire, just so I can get rid of this thing. Huh. Must have been the wind. You don't exist anymore. Whoa. Nicely done, dude. Now we're talking. Let it never be said that I can't explode, Moblin. <laughs> Why did it do <laughs> Let it never be said that I can't explode, my dumbass. That's not what happened. Nothing of down here. Nothing to worry about, man. And I left one left. Here, dude, have another. <laughs> what? Oh. Shit.
No, I... How about a little fire? Uh, excuse me, chaps. Let me just. Oh, you got like big armor on, huh? Oh, they called out the boss. Wait, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. What? What? You, my friend. Look like you would enjoy the, the application of a boulder hammer. Goodbye. Yeah, I know we're not done. I know we're not done. Yeah, what's up, man? Hey, 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 hey! <laughs> I'm out of here, dude! I'm getting calls. I don't want to. I don't want to get calls. Y'all just, like, forget about me? What? Are you fucking with me? I must, I must, uh, answer a text message. Give me one moment. Okay. Let's, uh, let's go back to bashing our face against this brick wall. I need to, I need to get better at dodging. Here's the thing you must know about me, apparently. Horse, we're gonna get better. Website, we're gonna get better at dog. That's the one. No way. Hello. Dude, this, this little routine for the third time in a row. No, there's nobody here, big guy. It's okay. No, 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 no. There's nobody here, big guy. Why am I getting rid of the hoe? Because I don't want it right now. Wait. Get out of here. Buddy, I gotta blow you up. You're so confused. Here, let me guide you. Uh, well. You may be right. Yes. Correct. I am transgender, as they call it. <laughs> Well, this time I got guts. Did 
Choose your words carefully. It's a wild west here on the internet. This time, I'm going to do this in a cool way. Nope, no, that was not cool. <laughs> that was actually extremely not cool. <laughs> it didn't prevent the boobs floating. I'm starting to think I should maybe, uh, Conduct myself to a different task. Or, or, we, we go again. Downstairs, young fellow. Ugh. Man, you guys hit hard. I don't really appreciate that about you. You know what I also don't appreciate about this game? Or, sorry. Not really don't appreciate. It's more that I haven't been giving due appreciation to. It's the fact that I can eat. <laughs> it's the fact that I got a bunch of tasty meals right here. <laughs> that can that can help me in a jam, such as when I am being murdered. Mmm, tasty. Oh, I didn't mean to put that on the bow. Shit. <laughs> Wait, can I take... Can I not? Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. Thankfully, that's a little less dire. I just wanted to open up. See, my problem is, if I put it on the hoe, it just, it makes the hoe lose its reach. It does make it a little tastier, though, I guess. I wish text messages would not keep coming. People, stop approaching my number. <laughs> what, does he want the other ones? Here you go. <gasps> Sorry to spook you, critter. Hmm. 
Mmm, baked apples. This is mine now. Off with you. Really? <gasps> Do you know what? One at a time. There are many kinds. You will have to go through them one at a time. It probably would, but I really like this shield. <laughs> Look at this big fucking shield. I could do a lot of things in different ways, but I'm not. Oh, they brought the big boy out. The lieutenant. Oh, yeah. I forgot I was lighting these guys on fire earlier. Oh, they brought the bigger boy out. No, 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 Honk. Here, fellas. I got something that you're all gonna like. They always leave. I, I've gone beyond there. Right, I might need some fire to make. Well, Pro is chucking. Oh, right. No, not a fit. That was very silly. Okay, this guy's got the right idea. He... Fall off the cliff, idiot. Yeah, I don't think the fan was it. I don't think the fan was it. I'll be real on that one. No, don't attack my fucking horse. Kidding me with that shit? Come here. 
No, that shit's mine. Wait, did he just... Excuse me? <laughs> oh no, thunder's happening. This isn't? This isn't electric? Fascinating. Are you just gonna be sitting happy over here? Do you have all your health back? Zona shit like clay. You know that kind of makes a degree of sense actually. Fine. Yeah, you get all your shit back. Must be nice being you. Give me this fucking meat. Oh, <laughs> oh I see. <laughs> I see. <laughs> Check this out. <laughs> Dummy. I'm gonna, I'm gonna steal some more bows soon. I hit the wrong butt! We're okay, we're okay, we're okay. Your stick doesn't actually give you that much. Yeah, you know what, buddy? Oh, this is <laughs> right, that was a bad idea. All right, big guys. Still kind of terrifying. Thanks for the bass, though. Oh, they got horns shaped like axes, huh? <laughs> An axe-shaped horn with a band I identify as belonging to a leader. Attach it to a weapon to moderately increase attack power or cook it with a critter to make an elixir. Attach it to arrows. God, he is full of teeth. They're all serrated. Sir, did you forget about me? Because I'll sneak attack you. Man, you gotta, like, the. Jesus! That's a powerful arrow! Ow! Okay. My man, did you just get struck by lightning? No. Oh. Yummy. Second time's a charm. <laughs> Melgarth saw three boss. Spiked Bokobo. Hey, cool. Upgrade Bokobo bound with animal bone boost to boost its durability and firepower. It's kind of super sloppy, but it's light and easy to use. Have some guts. Do, 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 do you have. I 
I've baked a lot of apples with all those explosions. I think we took out the majority of them. Look at the metal boxes. As if I have magnesis anymore. Oh, you can see the workings. This is the big balloon they have under there. Yo! This seems like a great place to get fucking murdered if you want to teleport here. It's like, oh, the blood moon happens. Enjoy this entire populated base again. Plug in the switch peripheral. Kajunk. You just rocket straight under, <laughs> just straight through the underside of an island. Where did I go? Will this ever get m less magical? Yeah, maybe. Hey, that's a chunk of the map we needed, actually, so... I regret nothing. Ooh, we got some sky landmarks. Anyways. You're now falling. Just like these rocks. Wait a minute. Yambi. <gasps> A golden apple. A rare, very sweet fruit that seems to have an extra sparkle to it. Sometimes we are near normal apples. Pretty sure there's like some crazy ass uh, mythical events that happened because of these things. Yeah. There's three of them. Sunday lines. Anything else here? over there but that's just kind of oh no that's still a floating surface hmm. this is just the the golden apples okay and sure as the Lord made little green apples <gasps> Fairy. <laughs> hey, little creature. Five finger patch to heal you the moment you lose your last heart. It's easily mistaken for a firefly at first, but it glows in the daylight as well as night. All kinds of birds to get bird meat from. I want you. I want you so bad. Come here. Get you my onions. Oh, I should not be trying to save time. I should have. Oh, I needed to approach that from higher. <gasps> Ducks!
I'm gonna make some duck soup. Well, uh, live and learn, I guess. Because that seems like a thing that's not climbable, but I could also be just mistaken. As I have been many a time. Where am I going? Well, there's the base. There's something over there, but it's not a shrine, apparently. Or at least not yet. There's a shrine. And over yonder-ish. That is to say, way over yonder-ish. So we'll, we can we can definitely meet some shrines on the way there. That's for sure. Like that one. Yeah, we'll be able to get somewhere. Can I teleport with my horse? Only one way to find out. Catch me website. No website, come with me! <laughs> My horse! Huh? Rescue is down under? Oh, I'm a Muppet. Well, look at this. You're the one I saw flying around the sky. It's great to meet the first one to ever be launched from a Skyview Tower. A real historic moment. Hey, what's your name? Woof. Link, you say. Oh, in there. Really, your name is Link? Hey, buddy. You got the same name as that famous swordsman. Ha, <laughs> good for you. Pretty big name to live up to, though. I'm Penn, by the way. I work for the Lucky Clover Gazette. I'm writing an article about this event, so folks everywhere will know about the Skyview Towers being activated. I better get to work. Our newspaper is short on staff, so I've had to flap all over the place to cover the news. Hey, we could use another reporter. You should join us. Seems like a brave type and all. That's what it takes. Oh. Our new newspaper is based in Hebra to the northwest. You'll find it near the bridge that leads to Reno Village. Stop by if you're up for the up for the adventure of a lifetime in the newspaper biz. Till then, so long. I think somebody believed in Link. <laughs> but nobody came. Wow! <laughs> Yikes! <laughs> yeah, for real, dude! Lester. I mean, I wasn't immediately going to. Well, okay, I guess website's stuck over there. Sorry, website, I really... really thought you'd, uh... I guess I'll walk. I guess I'll walk to the quarry ruins. Or now here's an idea. Yep. Yep. Hmm. 
very glad this is viable. <laughs> yeah, keep on doing that. Nice. You cannot activate while skydiving. <laughs> That's where we're going. Right about there. there's only so much gliding I can do. Damn. That's scary. Well, it doesn't help that it's... That it's so rainy right now. Jesus. One must carefully consider what to do when faced with a bunch of choo choos who won't leave me alone. <laughs> I know, man, I know. I'm right here with you, dude. I don't want any trouble. Oh, God, oh, God. That dude was full of lizards. Spicy peppers here. Good to know. Oh, we're almost out of the woods. I can see. I can see the, uh, yeah. I can see clearly now. The rain is gone. Is that the kind of stone that can be made into an axe? Sure looks like it. It's of a different breed. I hate when fans just hang around, you know? Huh. Oh. Well. Let's see what's going on in this. And then we'll, <laughs> then we'll equate.
sorry. I'm, just, I'm reading a chat message. Or a Discord message. Huh. Fascinating dreams about Ella Fitzgerald going on in other chats. I love when the synapses in your brain just fire. <laughs> they just kind of collect a couple stimuli and just start go insane. A windy device. Yeah, very much a, uh, hey, did you know? You now have a glider. Would you like to use a fan to make your glider go? And I say yes. I would, actually. And they're like, okay. The Spyfest theme is a special surprise. No. <laughs> You <laughs> find out on Saturday. <laughs> plug, plug, plug. Um. Anyways, it's a fucking handshake, fist bump, or hug. <laughs> Yeehaw! Ramp it. Yeah. Uh, I'm rocking team hug just cause hug, hugging. Yeah, you know I like hugging. I'm a hugger. Wait. What is? Oh, that's funny. It's a very like yeah sure I guess I'll pick that one kind of splat fest. Guess who remembered? Not that. Not that. Not that. Guess who remembered this power? Right now. It's me. Gems. Precious stones. Damn, is it not enough? There you go. Wait, wait. That's such a cool mechanic. Good shrine, good shrine. Hit the showers, boys. That's a shrine. is so full of notifications and I am the type of person whose brain sees notifications and wants them all dead but does need them I'm not gonna just turn off notifications and I won't know nothing but I also have to I have to bat them away like a cat that sees a bug 
This isn't Richmond. What is that? About a, like... That's not even a quarter of a thing, is it? Like a, a third? Or a sixth, rather? So you need six upgrades to, to get a full stamina wheel? I was gonna say, I might do, like, two more upgrades. Well, gee, okay. Back at it again. That's not... Put them together. What do you got? Bibbity bobbity boo. You got me a little higher up here is what you got. Huh, doesn't... I see. Can I grab you from here? Nope. But I don't think... Can I... Can I... Let me just, just dig it right up there. I'm running out of arrows. Did not really appreciate that until just now. <gasps> no! I could just climb this rock. <laughs> Guess I'll wait for my batteries to recharge. <laughs> stares at device. Turn on. Why am I having such trouble with this? Holy shit. <laughs> wow, a spiky club. Uh, well, it's marginally better than you, I guess. All right, where are we heading? We are heading roughly that direction. There is a stable. Didn't really need to mark it. You again. How many times do we gotta teach you this lesson, old man? Ow! <laughs> You're such a source of lizards. No, they're all crawling away! No! Just get off this rock! Chickaloo creep, treat it. My lizards! Golden apple nut. Why did I cut down the apple tree? I'm a monster. <laughs> this is just normal, Ren. I don't need to be scared. I do need to be scared a little. I 
don't fully remember fighting Henox strategies, but I do remember stealing their shit while they're asleep. <laughs> they wear funny, they have funny little hats on their horns now. Well, if I... I can't just climb on them? I thought that was a thing I could do. Oh, I know what I can do. I absolutely can't do that. No, it's nothing. It's nothing. Go back to sleep. I don't need this. <laughs> Oh, hey, it's one of those. Surely you don't want to follow me all the way to Kakariko Village, man. No! Get that thing! Is he still following me? Okay, he finally gave up. Yeah, sorry, dude. Gladys. Caves are really dangerous. Is is finding bubble gems even worth it? What? You got your hands on bubble gem? You got the courage to not only go in a cave, but to face down a strange creature? You're a brave one, that's for sure. You managed to get your hands on a bubble gem. You should try and find those two oddballs in Woodland Stable and Elden to the northeast. Those fellows are in a real frenzy to find those gems. I bet you'll find them in the cave near the stable. Had them talking about some rare treasure they had. I think it was a mystic robe or something like that. Yeah, it might not be a bad idea to go see him. I'm going here. That little beast ran in here. <gasps> Lizard! Oh fuck, there's like likes in here. I'm ready for you. Beasts are so truly unpleasant. But you did give me ten arrows. And whatever is in here. Salt! Oh boy! Well, I do like that. I don't like how it gives you the opportunity when you're opening chests. Um... Well? Well? A couple ways I could tackle this. Uh, one e really easy one, I guess. <laughs> Do gotta remember that more. It's very fun. Frog! I don't need to kill Frog. I can just grab him. This frog is tireless. He prefers dark and moist places. When he cooked the monster parts, the elixir produces will temporarily increase your stamina. Maximum stamina.
What was that noise? The hell? Get down here. You've won this day. He drowned! Horriblin. An elongated hammer shaped horn with a hard flat front. <laughs> make a hammer out of it. Why don't you make a hammer out of it, idiot? You're right. That was horrible. And never show me that again. Give me that last one. <laughs> Arr. <laughs> Caves and contains luminescent enzymes. Put it in a dish. Make make you glowy for a bit. Are these glowing fish? Special glow fish? No 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 no. That fish just died. Glowing cave fish. That fish just jumped into a wall and died. Oh, you can just grab them. You don't have to kill them. This is good to know. Secret waterfall. Secret cave waterfall. What? This shit's cursed. You telling me to take the shrine treasure behind the secret cave waterfall? This is how Noroi starts. This is how you just start seeing some demon out of the corner of your eyes everywhere you go. Oh, hey! My, my, oh, so dearly missed climbing gear. Yeah, now I can be in a cool t-shirt. It always pays to go behind Secret Waterfall. No, 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 no. This is a fun look. Oh, look at that frog go! Come here. I'm glad you don't have to kill the fish to get them. I mean, they'll die anyways. Oh, hey, man. Okay. Hmm. You telling me those guys will give me wizard robes if I bring them these things? That's fine. Who am I to argue with such an offer? Another fantastic offer. We got ceiling lizards? I'm sorry. I have to get one. Where did it go? <laughs> Dag nabbit! I picked the wrong ceiling lizard. <gasps> no! Come here.
No, 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 I want you. I want you. I always see a lizard like half a second too late. Hey, I got another one. Just wanted you to know. All right. What am I taking? Thank you. I'm gonna have to buy arrows from somebody. These have been running out way faster than anticipated. Butterfly. Mud butterfly. Can I butterfly fly down to me? Please. Butterfly. Come on. Eats it. Butterfly found in the woods and plains of warm regions. It wing its wings absorb the warmth of the sun. Cook it with moss spreads, create an elixir that makes you feel warm and fuzzy. Please, give me my horse back. <laughs> Not much of a wagon, but what if there was a horse on it? Got it. <laughs> Let me pet you. Let me pet the puppy. Sir, can you please give me my horse? <gasps> Bubby! Why can't I pet the dog? Nintendo, how did you not learn the one lesson? That's insane. Anyways. Here's some cooking. Let's cook some eggs. What if... What if this? A little of this? Yeah? A little of this? I'm sure we'll make something good. <laughs> salt grilled meat. Not not what I expected, actually. Shorten ingredients, just rip some meat and salt and cook for a simple tasty dish. Not what I expected to come out of that one. Not gonna lie. Uh, if I just... <laughs> oh, this? That's an omelet? It's got two eggs, which I feel like makes an omelet. No, this is fried wild greens now. These eggs do nothing. Alright, I'll figure it out later. I'll buy more eggs. Or steal them. Hey, my man. Need something? So you'd be better off as a stable worker for help. I'm just a visitor. My older brothers have been arguing incessantly about where to go next. It's exhausting. I got so tired of listening to them that I had to seek refuge out here. I don't put much faith in either legends or rumors, but more than that, I found the caves and fallen ruins caused by the upheaval to be a much, much more interesting area of study. There weren't caves before. Now there are. Isn't that crazy? Caves did not exist. Can I jump down a well? I, you know, I've been seeing wells. I've never thought to do it. 
Oh god. Oh god, there's a corpse here. I was gonna say, you look like a highly destructible rock. Flush. Fifty rupees. Its violet glow fills your heart with generosity. Why don't you give some money to the poor sometime? Give me arrows. Give me arrow, I guess. That one, that one got away from me. I'm sorry, is there no way to escape this place outside of teleporting? Because I did not set up a waypoint. Well, okay, I guess there is. And it's called the magic of crafting, but like... Oh, also. It's called the magic of that ability. <laughs> I'll never be buried alive. Or dead for that matter. Oh, customer. Hi there. Well, welcome to New Serene Stable. I'm kind of in the middle of something, but if you like to use a stable, you can go up to the counter. What you up to? <laughs> Oof. Uh, well, you, since you asked. Uh, after a long, tireless search, I found a wagon to call my own. Look at this butte. Oh, okay, yes, clearly it's a fixer-upper. But I can replace the missing wheels using building materials from the stable. I can just have to catch a wild horse to hook the wagon up to, and I'll be set. Building yeah. materials. Stash of unused building materials at every stable. No two stashes will have the exact same materials, ah. but they do have one thing in common. They're open for everyone to use, no questions asked. Ah. Wild horse. If you catch a wild horse, you can make it your own. There are lots of them around here, as a matter of fact. It's hard to catch them, though. You have to crouch in and sneak up on them, or they'll run away. Even after you do catch one, you have to sue the horse so you get thrown off. I always mess that part up. Fine, don't offer to help. Yeesh. Do I look like I can fix a horse-drawn wagon on my own? It's not as if I wouldn't pay you back. I'll just give all my savings, in fact. Alright, alright, alright. Whoa, what? Huh? What? That, it's fixed? Huh? It's fixed! Did you do this for me? Oh. Thank you so, so much! It's like a brand new wagon, with wheels and everything. Now I'm only one step away from my dream of having a horse-drawn wagon. Of course, that last hurdle is the hardest, catching a wild horse. As soon as I get near a wild horse, it runs off. How am I going to catch one? Do I need to get you a new horse, lady? Well, there's some over there. Fucking, why not? I'll give you website. Nice donkey. Wild, wild horses. Couldn't drag me away. What do we get you, lady? What do we get this fine woman? What about this cool, this funky calico horse? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Wild, wild horse.
Corsair. Okay, it's not as calico as I thought. Oh, we got a big boy over here, though. Well, anyways. Look at this beautiful field. Yeah, this is a perfectly average horse. Catch this angel for me. It's just what I pictured. P perfect for pulling my wagon. All yours? <laughs> no, I'm just showing you. Huh? You mean that? You really part with such a wonderful horse? Uh. Thank you. Wow, who knew stuff like this really happened? I'm so, so happy. I'll just go ahead and put a harness on it. A harness? Uh. A harness is a piece of equipment that you can put horses on, on horses you own. With a harness, you can connect your horse to a wagon or an item you need to take somewhere. Collect enough pony points, you can get one as a prize. So bear with me a moment. I'm rapidly switching accents for this woman. <sighs> and we're all set. I can't believe it. A wagon of my own. And a beautiful horse to pull it. I think I started with that old piece of junk and ended up with this. Amazing. <laughs> Thank you so, so much. Here, it's all I have left after buying the wagon. I'm begging you, no, forcing you to take it. Please. 100 bucks. It's dazzling silver light reflects your beaming smile. <laughs> oh, that's right. There's one last order of business. What's your name? Woo! Uh. Link? Hmm, Zoomy? Link? Maybe Zuli? Lumi? Or what about Zunk? I'll call this wagon Zunk. <laughs> Promise to look after Zunk as long as I live. Feel free to come visit the two of us anytime. <laughs> Breaking hearts all over the world, Link. Zunk! Can I get my, can I get my dog back? Yeah. Oh, new Serene Stable. Ah. Thank you for supporting the Stable Association. This is your first time here? We'll have one point to your pony points. Ding. Oh. Now then, once again, uh, welcome, Link. Do you want to register a horse or take one out for a ride? Uh. Oh. <laughs> Thank you for letting me teleport my horse to, to parts unknown. Actually, I might as well look, you know. I mean, website. Uh. I do like website. Uh. It's fine. Sorry, you're giving me mad horse tips. I didn't even notice. It's going to turn You're more likely to hit obstacles. Sink before you take your horse for a sprint. Ever since Hyrule Castle started flowing, things have been falling from the sky. This makes you wonder if this is the end of the world. Mm, I don't think it's that kind of Zelda. Still not used to this place. Weapon! Beast! Come again. A legendary weapon, you say? Anya, Mike. <laughs> Anya, give that a little more thought. Things with legendary in the title are usually just stories. There's simply no way it exists. But the rumored beast you're after, that's just a story. Hmm. No, no, go to any stable in Iowa. You'll find people excited about the rumored beast. Stables are places where information gathers. <laughs> if it weren't true, you wouldn't hear, so hear about it at so many stables. Oh. Even if I grant you that, we don't stand to gain anything by finding this rumored beast. A legendary weapon, on the other hand, is bound to be strong indeed. We would have nothing to fear of monsters. And what if this weapon is legendarily brittle and useless, huh? Let's start visiting stables to gather information and track down the rumored beast. And so they go on. Do I get a pony point if I stay here? I 
I gotta get my rewards card up. We gotta, we gotta get the points. Ah. Good uh, afternoon. <laughs> ah. So you got some points saved up, Link. Want to get your rewards? Step to the side counter. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Be right with you. Ah. Ah. Horse god fabric. Tough fabric bearing design of horse god millennia. Looks like it'd be used to make a paraglider. Ooh. Oh. The dye shop in the same village is a new service using fabric. You ever find yourself in Nekluda, you ought to stop by. I'm sure they can put this fabric to use. You save up just two more points, you'll be able to use the millennia bed. Just said to bring prophecies from the horse guard millennia. You heard this shit website? Now I don't want to fully replace you website, but but I do want to get more horse. We can hold six of the damn things. I'll never truly replace you. Who just chilling here? Is that Impa? Oh yeah, the balloon's there. Uh, hold on. Where is... Slap that one down there. I want one of these. Hmm. This is just kind of a brown brown and white version of website. And not as good. Goodbye. Well, so it goes. Seneca whack. Is Seneca whack? An uplifting device. Again? Oh, but this time a balloon. You might be learning about these more soon. Balloon. Look at that. But what if it had platforms on it? Huh? What then, huh? Oh. <laughs> this is a funny, funny thing. I see. That's cute. Now put a fan on there and you can get really in business. Need to make a touch out at this point, right? Uh, 
Ah, uh, but see if it. <laughs> but see if they t if they came together, they could float forever. Simple as. What are these catwalks? Are you hiding things? Prizes? Treats? Treats for Link? Treats for Link? Oh, my balloon's up here. Would you like to ride in my beautiful balloon? This is a fun little soundtrack. Well, that's a flame jet. We have thing that needs orb. Two thing that needs orb, really. One small orb, one one bigger orb. There's big orb. Borb. Here too known. There's smorb. And there's balloons. What more do you want, truly? No, 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 come back. This is very funny. See what you've done here, game. It's very convenient. So, S'more bleeds to the end of the level. But Borb. Now that's a... I don't know if this is working quite the way I wanted it to.
Okay, hold on. This is too heavy for your standal standled. Your standard uh your standard tactic. Even like a double version. It does seem a little too heavy for this. But we might as well just see it in action. <laughs> I mean, it's going. Like, it might take a bit, but it's going. Why did I, I didn't need a third candle, I needed a third balloon. Why did I grab that? You know, website. That for momentum is still happening. Even if I can't fully appreciate it. I don't know what I'm I am physically leaning over as if that's going to help me. I'm again, I'm I'm physically leaning over. There we go. There, get that on there. Yeah. That's making it slightly less. Now give me that. Gimme. Give Gimme. Give, give it to me. Give it. Give it. Whatever this treasure is, it better not be. Sure have. Not playing Tekken right now. It's fucking new Mishima. Um, or not. I don't know. Everyone's saying it's new. Heiachi's got 23 kids, right? Fucking. I still. Th I'm. I'm calling that it's a. Uh, that it's Kazuya's bastard child. He's another bastard child. She looks neat. Oh yeah, Lars is also... I kind of forgot that, but that's... 
I would say I like one of Tekken spoilers, <laughs> if only because I didn't play through all of the Tekken 5 story mode. But I guess that's on me. Tekken 6, sorry, not Tekken 5. Yeah, that's a real bad man. Hey, we have enough for another upgrade. They put Harachi's brain and put it in a computer. You can't do that. I'm the owner of the Mishima Corporation. Let's go, website. What is it meant to depict? Hi, Grandma. Hey, Abba. What a surprise it is to see you here after all this time, Link. Hello. I heard you had gone missing. It is certainly a relief to see you back, and in one piece, more or less. More, <laughs> more or less. Princess Zelda, where is she? Woof! What? She still has yet to return? In that case, we must use all available means to search for her. Link, when Princess Zelda went missing, something else happened all over Hyrule. During the upheaval, huge pictures appeared out of nowhere, images that sprawled across fields and hills. Oh. We are calling them geoglyphs. I understand that they have found, been found in locations across the kingdom. Kato and I are traveling from region to region in hopes of seeing them all. Oh. I noticed this geoglyph from a distance while I was standing on high ground. Examining it up close, I could not make out what it depicted. I thought it might have a better view. I thought I might have a better view from up in the sky. I took to the air and the balloon Pura gave me, but then, alas, the wind struck and completely sheared the balloon off base. I have racked my brain for ways to reattach the two parts to no avail. Grandma, I got great news. Are you proud of me? Uh, material. <laughs> Sorry. See ya, Grandma! I mean, I already saw it from the sky. It was awesome. Huh? Hey, come back! You forgot me! Game over. Yeah. Hmm, starting over. All I need is a clear view of the geoglyph. Try to move us straight upward without going in other directions. Well then get on! Come on, Impa. Hmm. Oh, you fixed my balloon? Thank you, Link. Will you come with me to look at the geoglyph then? Sure. Oh. It's time to head out then. Ah, I nearly forgot. Would you mind doing one final thing for me?
Light a fire there, and the balloon will start to float. Then we can be on our way. It's your thing, Grandma. Oh my god, I gotta find Hestu! Be gone! Yeah, it's good. Higher. Oh. Too high up. I feel faint. Hmm. But finally, we can see it. The geoglyph. Well done, Link. You know, I read something in the village's old literature. A passage about what the ancients called Dragon's Tears. Where the tears rest upon the earth, we mark down the images to which they give birth. Huh. It rhymes, so it must be true. I believe this geoglyph is one such image, but even from this vantage, its meaning is no clearer to me. Nor can I figure out what dragon's tears might be. But you know, if the literature is correct, one of them should be quite close, near the geoglyph, or even within its borders. Yeah. Would you look around? This could be the clue we need to discover Princess Zelda's whereabouts. If you'd like to examine the geoglyph from ground level, you can float down with a paraglider. No need to worry about me. I can manage a simple landing. Bye. So jump, idiot. Well, there's like a bunch of rocks I see. I see one eyeball. What? She teleported. Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> Look at it. Look at it! Landed in my eye! Ow! Anyways, take this. We saw you from across the bar, and we really love your vibe. Where am I? We didn't mean to startle you. I'm sorry. It's okay. My name is Sonia. And could we ask what your name is? I... I am the daughter of King Rome of Hyrule, Zelda. What an unexpected answer. We are the king and queen who founded Hyrule, after all. Or at least we were the last time I checked. You two founded mm. Hyrule? And you're the king? Zelda time dimension confirmed. Mm. My name is Raru. King Raru of Hyrule. King Raru? And Queen Sonya? Uh, well, that must mean... Oh. 
What are you doing? What are you showing me? Three? Oh, man. <laughs> oh. Tear of the Dragon 1. Never mind. That's the, it's the third cinematic because there's others. Neat. Oh, yeah, but Nate, you look distracted. Uh, I found it in the... Uh, the climber's gear was in the cave that was near the stable, uh, behind the waterfall. You look distracted. What's wrong? Woof, woof, woof. Arr. Goodness, you say you had a vision. It's all mysterious figures. And then Princess Zelda? Hmm. The geoglyphs, the literature, the dragon's tears, and now a vision of the lost princess. What if these are all connected? Let's continue to examine the geoglyphs. They may contain further clues that lead to Princess Zelda. You know, according to the literature, there's something to do with geoglyphs in the Forgotten Temple. Forgotten Temple lies at the bottom of a can- <laughs> But I forgot. Canyon and Hebra. I think we should make our way there soon. Wowie zowie. Yeah, okay. We didn't get number one yet? <laughs> what? I mean... Yeah. <laughs> Regional phenomena. They want the Ruta. Well, all that shit. Curse of the Hell Castle. Dragon's Tears. Fine Prince cast Zelda. Okay. Dragon Sears and the regional phenomena are basically our main lead here. They sure are kind of leaning a little towards the... Ka Kakariko Village is on the... Yeah, it's all over there. That's way over there. <laughs> Alright, website. Hmm... Looks like we got so many things. Ah, uh, fun. There's that cave over there. We truly got markings living in all all regions at this point. That's not too far for a tower. I suppose going to the Rito first isn't a terrible idea. Pe they've really been guiding me there, which is making me wonder. But I guess they've been guiding me kind of any which direction. They were like, hey, Zora going over there. What you know. I figure we should wrap up s relatively soon anyways. You recommend Rito Town? Alright. But what if I did something different? What if I wanted to be different, huh? I guess it would be different from Breath of the Wild, which was distinctly the Zora first. <gasps> My friend! My homeboy! Give me more weapon slots! Those trees over there! So scary, Shalaka. <laughs> if I hadn't already seen this shit with my own two eyes. That would be very funny. You! <laughs> I killed a bird! I killed a bird with a fastball. Oh man. I hate that you have to pick these up. Okay. Alright, alright. I jumped into him. Hey, we're gonna make so much f 
fucking beetle money. Yeah, who else wants some? Yeah. Shall I call? The scary things are gone. Hi, Hestu. You see me? You see me! My name is Hestu. We've met, man. Have you forgotten me? I'm a musician of Korok Forest, up, up northeast. I'm known for my maracas and my dancing. Thanks for your help. Shashaka. Show my appreciation. I'll do a little dance for you and make your, ba make your pouch bigger. But my maracas aren't working anymore. The Korok seeds inside are all gone. How am I supposed to dance now, Shoko? Children of the forest must have taken them again. If I had even one Korok seed, I could sing and dance and use my powers to help you. Yeah, man, here. Korok seeds make a really good sound when you put them in maracas. But the seeds spilled all over the place when I broke my maracas. I think the children of the forest took the seeds while I was all in a panic. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> the fucking bear in the big blue house. <laughs> do you have a Korok seed? You do? <laughs> you got a Korok seed from one of the forest children. If you give me a Korok seed, I'll make your inventory bigger. Yes, please. Shalaka! So which stash do you want more slots in? Weapon. Sh okay, I'll just need one Korok seed. Deal? Here you go. Let the expansion begin! Oh, shit! Massive upgrades. Hooray. One more. Na, 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 na. Expand a bam bam weapon stash. Shakala. So? So? Are you happy with it? If you bring me more Korok seeds, I'll expand your inventory again. Can't go wrong with more speed. <laughs> I'm in the middle of traveling. I'm thinking about heading east next. So many monsters he says that traveling is dangerous. I'd like to find somewhere I can relax. I like lively places, so maybe I'll go somewhere where lots of people hang out. Wait a sec. You still have cork seeds on them. I can smell them. I'm here a little longer. Want me to make your pouch even bigger? Yeah, let's just, uh... Yeah, let's... Let's, uh, let's bump up everything a little bit. Though I need to find some more bows. Oh, look at the time. I gotta get moving on. I'll be in. So I don't know. Oh, shit. Didn't think you would just stop. Man, I got a bunch of Korg seeds. Are you sure you don't want some more? You don't want some more, Hestu? Please, man. I should have just bumped up my weapons twice. Whatever, we'll just pick up a bunch more bows. It's that easy. Huh. Huh. Well, more speed. Huh. No, it's fine. Truly, truly, it's fine. Wait, this is a cave. <laughs> Website, don't go in there. I'll go in there. Does it mark? It does mark caves. As long as you, as long as you take a step in them. But does it mark it as complete or is it? No. Okay. Is it only if you get the frog? Yo, watch the frog. Yeah, that makes sense. Seems to be the main objective of cave. But then you can come back to grind uh, bright seeds and shit. 
or bright fish. I'm gonna drown. Okay, I definitely need to get get moving then very soon. Um, you know what? <laughs> That's it. We'll explore this. <laughs> I drowned. Uh, uh, Ben drowned. The end. <laughs> That's uh that's that's all we get for today. I I got I got a food to eat and other things to do. So we'll see you next time whenever that is.